Hey guys, so I wanted to talk to you a little bit about these fat burning meals that we talked about last week on our Facebook Live and making our body a fat burning machine. So what I did, I had a lot of questions from folks asking me, what about my regular low calorie meals that I eat all the time? Are they still good for me? And the answer to that is yes. I just wanted to show you the difference between what most people see as a low calorie perfect for you kind of meal to lose weight and a fat burning meal and why you might want to choose a fat burning meal. So first of all, what I have here are basically just two meals uh, that people might eat. One is just a fried egg with some tomatoes and spinach and a little bit of cilantro sprinkled on top and the other and I haven't put this in the microwave yet. This is just some chocolate chip whole grain oatmeal and some fruit. So typically, people on a busy day might say, hey, I'm just going to have a bowl of oatmeal and some fruit, and that is great. This meal right here would probably be right around 200 calories. This is a packaged oatmeal, so it's 140 calories. I added a little bit of skim milk plus the cantaloupe, so it's going to be right around 200 calories. Good fiber, good energy with the cantaloupe, but we're worried sometimes about the carbs and fruits. Um, and we also get some good antioxidants from those dark chocolate chips are in there. Now, when we flip over to this here, some people steer away from eggs in the morning because they think that it might be too long, take a little too long to, to prepare. And I just wanna let you know that this particular egg here took me about 30 seconds to fry up. And when we talk fat burning meals, this is what we're talking. We need three components in a fat burning meal. We need an animal protein, we need a healthy fat, and we need some energy veggies. And we have all of that right here. With this egg, that's my animal protein. It's a good, healthy protein. Eggs provide great protein. Um, with the healthy fat, I use just a little bit, maybe a teaspoon of canola oil to fry this up in. And then we added the good energy veggies in the spinach and the tomatoes. Now, on top of that, where we're looking at around 200 calories here, and probably because we don't have a whole lot of protein here, we might get a little bit hungry later. There is some good fiber, but not a whole lot of protein. We're looking at right around 100 calories here. 100 calorie breakfast, full of protein, full of energy, and it will be great. It's a great way to satiate you throughout the morning, but also get your energy levels up. So that's just one of the differences between just a healthy low cow meal like this and a good fat burning meal like this fried egg and spinach and tomato. We'll check back in again next time and make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel here, Equipped for More with Julie House, and check us out on Facebook and Instagram too. Thanks so much.